Hello students, in this video we will talk about the formation of compound sentence. What is compound sentence? How is it made? Let us take the demonstration for compound sentence. So students, compound sentence is made up of two or more main classes. A compound sentence consists of two or more main classes and it is called a compound sentence. But these main classes are linked or joined with coordinating conjunction and but are yet so etc. So keep in mind the definition a compound sentence is made up of two or more main classes joined by a coordinating conjunction and but are yet so etc. And what is main class? This is also the question. Main class mean a sentence, a part of a sentence which keeps its meanings fully understandable for the readers. So, let's take the examples of compound sentences. He completed his work and he put it in his binder. Basically, this is a compound sentence and a it has two classes and both the classes are representing an independence in itself. Look at the first part and first class of the sentence. He completed his work. So, this is a complete sentence. He completed his work. This is the main class because it conveys the full meanings and if we ignore this coordinating conjunction and read this sentence, he put it in his binder. He put it in his binder is also a main class. So, these two main classes are joined with a coordinating conjunction and so as a whole this is called a compound sentence in English grammar. Let's take the other example. I like apples but I like pears more. These two main classes are joined with a coordinating conjunction but. So, I like apples is a main class. I like peers more is also a main class. And both these main classes are joined with coordinating conjunction but. So, this is a compound sentence. Keep in mind the definition. A compound sentence is made up of two or more main classes joined by a coordinating conjunction. So, this is joined by coordinating conjunction. This main class and this main class. Because this class is also an independent class and this class is also an independent class. They are not dependent on one and other. Because they are equal in length and equal in meanings. Let's take another example. My pencil was broken. So, I borrowed one. My pencil was broken is a main class. I borrowed one is also a main class. Both these main classes are joined with the coordinating conjunction. So, so this is called a compound sentence. So, students, after this demonstration, I am sure you are well aware of the formation of